What's going on, guys? Uh, you know, I was doing some material for uh, a preview of the Eastern and Western Conference uh, finals in the NHL, and I was also working on a little bit of a Raider video, but while working on it, over my phone, ESPN man, nah, 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 has broken the news that both Cam Chancellor and Doug Baldwin have been released by the Seattle Seahawks. And you could say, well, who the shit cares? We're a Raider channel. Still breaking news. I mean, the NFL, that's a huge, huge thing. Um, both guys, I, according to some sources, both guys failed their physicals, which means that the Seahawks have the option to terminate their contract. It doesn't mean that they're not coming back at a smaller price. But still, if this is what's going on and this is what the Seahawks wanted to do, it's a pretty big story. Uh, you know, Doug Baldwin has always been around as the number one receiver for the, um, for the Seahawks. And Cam Chancellor was one of those guys in the Legion of Boom. I mean, it's just, it's, Crazy, 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 crazy. And, you know, I, I thought about it, and, you know, I say it's crazy, but I've got to be a devil advocate against myself. Is it that crazy? It's 2019. You know, Doug Baldwin and Camp Chancellor are on the other side of their prime. And it's tough, because it's just like back in the 80s, going into the 90s, when Joe Montana left the Chiefs, or left the 49ers to go play for the Chiefs, it was tough for guys to swallow it. And you know why? Because we grew up watching these players. So there's a little place in our heart for those kind of players. As much as some fans hated the Legion of Boom, you'll always remember it you will always remember it of how just crazy that Legion of Boom was and how many people they beat the shit out of. Cleanly beat the shit out of. Now, not many people are Richard Sherman fans, but I like Browner, I like Thomas, and I like Chancellor. Um, you know, Sherman gets his respect where his respect is due. One of the best corners to play in the league uh, during that time. Uh, you know, obviously that interview with Aaron Andrews is epic, but still... Um, yeah, so both Camp Chancellor and Doug Baldwin are out as Seattle Seahawks. They might come back, you know, maybe if the failed physical thing is true, you never know. Um, but I think from the Raiders perspective, and I'm going to put it, put it in this, I don't think the Raiders go after Baldwin and I don't think the Raiders go after Chancellor. Um, they just don't need it. They just don't need it. You know, there's already got a lot of receivers i know you could say well you know it's never too much to add more receivers but do you really want to add doug baldwin into the mix because they bring in all these guys and draft hunter renfro i mean it's just there we don't need a receiver right now which is crazy to say as a raiders fan but we don't need a receiver right now on defense you could always have extra players but i just don't think the raiders could afford what camp chancellor is looking for don't be surprised to see him on like the uh cowboys uh maybe even browns i mean the browns are scooping up everybody don't be surprised if fucking baldwin goes to the browns how crazy would that be so but yeah so doug baldwin and camp chancellor both out as seattle seahawks iconic players for that organization always tough to see because we grew up watching them and it was a lot of fun to watch them so all right guys we will see you soon i'm gonna have a couple videos coming out quick but uh you know that's part of youtube right all right we'll see you guys soon go raiders